Welcome to another free access video tutorial brought to you by AccessLearningZone.com. My name is Richard Rost. In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you about the can grow and can shrink properties in your access reports. Here I've got a real simple contact history report. You can see I've got the contact name, the company name, the phone number, the date and time of the contact, and some notes down here. Now you'll see some of these records have a real small note, others have a real big note, and even still, some others have no note whatsoever. If you look at the design view, you'll see I've got my field set up in the detail section. There's my first name and last name, company name, phone number, date and time, and the notes are down here below. Now when you generate the report, when you go to print preview, you'll see the notes section here can grow to be as large as it needs to be to display all the data. Text boxes by default can grow vertically to be as large as they need to be. However, sometimes you want to get rid of that extra space in there if there are no notes. Because you can see down here, for example, we're wasting a lot of extra space right in here because there's no notes. So how do we fix that? How can we make that section shrink up if no notes are found in that record? Well, let's go back to design view. Open up the properties for the notes box by double clicking on it. That brings up the property sheet. If you scroll down to the bottom of the property sheet, you'll find the can grow and can shrink properties. There's can grow and can shrink. Now normally they're both set to yes. The text box can grow to be as large as it needs to be or it can shrink up to nothing if there's no data there. So what's the problem? Why are we still seeing blank space there? Well, in addition to the text box itself, the section that the text box is in also has can grow and can shrink properties. You can see them by bringing up the properties for the detail section. Double click there. That'll bring up the property sheet for the detail section. Go to the format tab. There's the can grow and can shrink properties. Now, normally, can grow is set to yes, but can shrink is set to no. So if this detail section was that big, for example, when you generate your report, it's going to look like that. It cannot shrink. It can't get any smaller than the size you specify for it. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn that can shrink property to yes. Now what's going to happen is if the notes are blank, that text box will shrink up to nothing and then the details section can shrink up and fill that space. And now, if I take a look at my report in print preview, you'll see there is no extra blank space if the notes box is empty. And that's how the can grow and can shrink properties work. The trick there is that most people don't know the section also has a can grow and can shrink property. If you want to learn more, about formatting reports. I cover this and lots more in my Access 2010 Beginner Level 9 class. You can find that on my website at accesslearningzone.com. You'll find a link to this lesson in the comments below the video. Be sure to subscribe for updates, post your questions in the comments section, and let me know what you thought of today's lesson. Thanks and we'll see you real soon.